Hey guys, what's shaking? It's Thursday and it's going to be 76 degrees today. Super excited. It looks nice and sunny and beautiful. It's a little chilly now, but it's uh, 1030 in the morning, so it's going to get a little warmer. Um, I have a few things to tell you guys today. I am proud to say that I am going to be the brand ambassador for a new supplement company. Let me show you. Let me see if I can find them now. Man, I just had it. Okay, so this is their Instagram page. Hopefully you can see it. It's called gooddealsupplements.com. All right. So hop on there, you guys. I'm going to have a discount code for you soon. Um, I'm going to be doing a photo shoot with them. Um, I'm going to be posting a lot about them on my Instagram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, I am beautiful underscore muscle. So find me and follow me. Get some good deals on some great supplements. Um, I can't wait to get some samples in the mail. They're going to send me, um, they're going to send me t-shirts. Yay. Super stoked about that. I'm also in talks with a, a clothing company, um, a lifting clothing line to be a brand ambassador for them as well. That one is kind of not so sure yet. So I will let you know when it's for sure. Um, okay. So now that that's out of the way. Didn't I ask you not to do that today? Huh? Come here. I love you. I love you too. Can you say hi? Hi, you too. Can you see she's in her shorts, ready for the summer weather that we're having in October? <laughs> okay, go down and watch your cartoons. We are probably going to go to a playground or a park somewhere, do some Yay! fun, fun outdoor stuff, and take advantage of the beautiful weather. <laughs> Okay, go watch our shows, okay, sweetie? And drink your juice. Um, yeah, I'm about to make some oatmeal because I'm pretty hungry. I was hungry all day yesterday, too. I think you, you know how I was talking about how I had, like, an increased, um, bless you, <laughs> um, uh, sensitivity to some, uh, stimulants and stuff. Something's going on with my metabolism, I think, you guys. It's like going crazy because I lost two pounds and I haven't really been trying to lose weight. I haven't been doing a bunch of cardio or anything. Um, I haven't been doing anything outside the norm. I've been eating pretty much what I want to eat. Lost two pounds. I feel a little slimmer in the waistline area, so yay, I'll take it. Um, I don't know if the two are related, my stimulant thing and the dropping two pounds, but yeah, I'm 134 as of yesterday at Experience Fitness. I have been sitting at 136 for, I don't know, six months now. Um, and this is like my ideal weight. This is what I always thought of as my ideal number on the scale, even though I don't weigh myself that much and um, I don't like to be obsessed with weighing myself, but I'll take the two pound weight loss. <laughs> But I'd like to take those two pounds and stick them on my booty. Wouldn't that be awesome? <laughs> All right, you guys. I don't know what I'm going to do for workouts today as per usual. I know I need to get a bunch of stuff done. I need to find that key for my P.O. box. Um, but we're definitely, like I said, going to take advantage of the nice weather while we can. Um, okay, guys. I'm done talking for now. I'll come at you again later. Oh yeah, you guys, I also wanted to tell you, yesterday I spontaneously decided to go back on Bumble. <laughs> and like, by this morning, like I flipped through a couple people last night, um, by this morning I was out of people already. There must not be a lot of people on that app or something. I don't know what it is, but I always run out of people. Damn it. Um, I think I'm going to get down and get serious about doing some dating. Mm -hmm. It's time. It's time to start dating. So I'm going to use one of these packets of apple and cinnamon flavored Quaker Oats. I haven't used a flavored one in a long time. Served. 
Oh my God, you guys. So I just noticed that my camera was set to vivid. Maybe that's why um, certain places like my room and the bathroom, I look super yellow and orange. Duh. I really gotta look into how to set this camera correctly because I really don't know yet. I watched a couple of YouTube tutorials when I first got it, but um, I'm sure there's so much more that I don't know and I need to learn. All right, did changing that mode make this better? Am I still yellow? Is it still yellow in here? You guys, so I was just thinking about how I went back on Bumble and I remembered something that my friend Carrie, who I was training a week or so ago, um, said something to me. We were talking about dating apps and whatnot. And she said to me something that really got me thinking, like, She's like, well, did you ever think, you know, maybe guys just judge you and, you know, they see a, bl you know, girl with big boobs, blonde hair, you know, pink in her hair, tattoos, and they think that you're something you're not. And I was like, maybe that is the issue. Like, maybe my look is attracting all of the wrong kind of guys and the wrong kind of attention. And I'm kind of responsible for that, huh? But it's not like I'm going to be like, okay, I'm going to get all my tattoos removed and not be as, you know, I guess different as I am. I mean, I'm never going to like look like your normal everyday like soccer mom chick. That's just not me. But that doesn't mean that I'm not a good person or that I'm not loyal or that I you know, go out and party every day and whatever. Like, I mean, I don't really know for sure if that's what guys think about me, but what if they do? That'll explain a lot, huh? So we have to do a quick Walmart run for pull-ups. Because I said by the end of this last diaper pack I bought, Gio would be potty trained. And she did really good the last couple days, but a little bit of an accident today, so... But Mama's glad I made poopy. Yeah, I'm glad she made poopy. <laughs> but I wish it was in the toilet and not in her diaper. Alright, so here we go to Walmart. And that's the first time I opened up my sunroof. Ooh. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, you guys. I was so excited. It seemed like my mount was going to stick. And then I turned the camera around and the sticky came off. Damn it. Damn it. And we're going to listen to a little Moana soundtrack here. bought pull-ups. I got some yogurt. Oh, and then I saw this. You guys know that I'm addicted to kettle corn these days. We got some boom chicka pop. And it's sweet and salty kettle corn. 
but it's supposed to be low calorie, made of whole grains, non-GMO, gluten-free, all that nonsense. Oh, it looks like there's even protein in there. Oh, one gram. I thought it said 10 grams. I was like, woohoo. Um, and then, oh, I bought my face like things to get my makeup off. And, you guys, so I did a glycolic acid peel on my face last night. Like, I just feel like my skin is just looking like, I mean, not even like, well, I guess I had a little bit of a breakout here and like one up here, but like makeup is just not sitting right on my face. Like it's falling into my creases in my eyes, like right here. Like it looks like I put a bunch of powdery crap on, but I didn't even put powder on. So I'm going to have to find a different foundation. Like I've been, re I really loved the Wet n Wild one when I first started getting it, but I feel like the lighter paler colors that I have now are just like a, <coughs> excuse me, a different formulation. Like it's just like cakier looking and I don't like that. So, well, I gotta look for something else and there's going to be nothing else in that price point. That's for sure. That stuff was so cheap and I was so excited that it worked so well on my face, but I guess not now that I'm so pale. I need paler colors, but not cakey looking. I definitely don't want anything to enhance the wrinkles around my eyes. That's for damn sure. So yeah, I got two moist, moisture masks. This one is the Moisture Balm one that I know I love. And this one was only a dollar and it's like collagen boosting. And you know how I love my collagen. Yuck. Gross skin, irritated eyes. Get all my makeup off. Get one of those masks on ASAP. Watch Botched and edit my video. Have a great day!